doing a little mite treatment to my beehive today. Chris, we're trying, and Brittany, we're trying out my Father's Day gift, my smoker. And put that inside. There you go. You can see we got some nice smoke coming out of there. Okay, that is perfect. We're using these rubber glove throwaway gloves um, because the formic acid is not something you really want on your gloves. It's a mite away quick strip. We're going to put two of these strips in to our hive, leave it in for seven days, and it should effectively treat it. Varroa mites. There's some bees in here, but not a lot. Uh, we kept them, kept a queen excluder out. So right now there's not a whole lot happening. This is the top super, so they're not really filling this top super yet. But they are filling the brood chamber up. Bees in here, they're pretty docile right now. They seem pretty mellow. They do seem to have filled... Oh, let's see. One, two, three, about four frames on this top brood super. They have filled in a lot of frames here. They got a lot of frames on this top one filled. One, I'm counting one, two, three, four, five, six. Most of them are filled on this brood chamber. Whew, could mean that we got both of them filled. That's a lot of bees. But I think we're going to try and pop one of these off. This baby is full of capped honey. Just full of capped honey. Looking to make sure that's not the queen down there. This one's fairly big. Ooh, that could be the queen. I don't want this one to come out. I'm going to be pretty careful with that. I'm having trouble seeing if that's her or not. Looks like that's just a drone. Oh, there is a ton of honey in here though. This frame is very, very full. There are not, uh, not a lot of spots in here for brood anymore. Looking at the bees, they, uh, they do seem in nice health. I'm not really seeing anything on their wings. Uh, they don't seem to have any deformity issues. I'm going to flip this frame around. Okay, and this is the other side of it now. And again, there's a lot of honey in here. A lot of honey. Some of it's even dripping out. I'm trying to keep it over the hive. The bees all seem pretty happy at this stage. Can't tell if that's a drone. Doesn't look like the queen. Okay, I'm not seeing the queen in here. There is just a ton of honey on here though. Ton of honey on this frame. This one's not really capped yet though, but the other side here, this is all capped honey on this side. Inside the hive, things look like they're going pretty well. From what I can see, I could pull more frames out, but I think I'll just leave that in. Okay, this stuff really smells pretty strong. Alright, so I managed to pull this apart. I'm going to peel it open. Now, what's in here is basically formic acid. So I'm going to lay these strips on. There's two different strips in a packet. All right, so we got the second one on. So we got our two strips. They're on here perpendicular to the frames. They're covering all the frames. Okay, these don't seem too agitated by things. They should effectively take care of all of our mites. We're gonna leave this on here for seven days with these strips. Leftover formic acid, our mite away strips there. So we're going to place this, place the uh, cover back on, and we should be all set. We're going to leave it on there for seven days. We will come back uh, next Saturday or Sunday at the latest because it's late day on Saturday. And take this off, and we should have treated for mites. Uh, I would say that right now the colony seems to be doing quite well.